Wow, wow, wow. I don't even know what to say here. Uh, you might be wondering, what the F are we doing here? But we're going to have a little podcast time. The couple on a couch. That's what it's going to be called today. Because I am telling you, when I say this, we literally had the worst day ever. There's about eight things we need to talk about. This could be a five-minute video. This could be a three-day video. I don't know. But it was absolutely horrible. And you guys are in for a treat, babe. Roll some intro thing. Um. All right, so let me just go ahead and start with a little intro. And then clever. You know what? No, you start with the intro. Because I feel like I've said everything so far. So you're up first, babe. Let's hear what it is. Let's go. I don't even know where to start. All right, I'll start. So pretty much what happened was we were going to make a big step to our channel. Uh, you know, there's changes going on in the back end. And what we did was we went out and bought two mics, not these mics, mics that you hook onto your shirt. And it's a, it's amazing. You can adjust levels and stuff like that. And, uh, we'd go to the store, right? We go to one store, the one like 20 minutes away from our house. Right. And, uh, we go, Hey, we'll take two of these. Like, okay, one second, come back. Oh yeah. Sorry. We don't have any of those mics. So we're like, <laughs> Okay, so uh, then they say, oh, yeah, just drive to the one 30 minutes away. So really 50 minutes from us, and they got two brand new on the shelf, right? Oh, so we go there. We got them, and these mics aren't aren't cheap. Should we say the price? Might as well. $1,100 for two mics to get good, crisp audio, okay? So we drive 50 miles that way, get the thing, or 50 minutes that way, probably like 40 miles, whatever it is. Get the mics, come back. We start using them. I open the box, and the first one, I'm like, oh, this is cool. This is cool. Open up the second box. Realize that the two boxes are completely different with the contents inside. We didn't even get anything right. One box was legit, but the second box was completely off. It wasn't even the right mic. It was a mess. We got all mad. Had to go return it, and we'd have no new mics. That, took, that was like four hours right there. We wasted literally four hours of our day, and now we're not done yet. Babe, take over what happened next. Well... I feel like we need to give the people a little bit more of a background than what we've been giving them. AK, like, we know, we know, I feel like know. you really jumped into that story with a lot of passion and anger. And the truth is, is the reason that we're making this video is because what? <laughs> this week has been, well, it's only Monday, but these last, this last week has just been just everything is just falling apart so it just kind of we just kind of want to make a little story time let you guys yeah. in on our lives so you guys know and th <laughs> what's this, going on. this video might not even go live when like when claire yeah, our editor is editing this there is a very good chance something is wrong with this video i don't know what it will be but there could be something mad like could be an echo like literally for the last three hours we were dealing with these mics which once again aren't cheap these are some high quality mics to make you guys feel happy about yourselves but literally they were going <laughs> And we're like, what? <laughs> what is going on here? But uh, I think we figured it out, hopefully. But uh, yeah, how about on a brighter note? How about we talk about that little friend we saw on our way back from Taco Bell? Oh, yeah. And I'll be sure to bring the mood down yeah. ASAP. Don't worry. This is just going to be really just more of like a story time. So if you guys want to grab your popcorn, you guys want to, you know, grab a, a drink, a snack. I don't know. Grab some fingernail Do clippers. It because we're want, literally yeah. just going to give you story time and if you guys like podcast type videos like this and want us to do like a weekly one a daily one i mean i don't yeah. honestly whatever you guys want so let us know but we kind of like isn't this cool like it's a cool little thing i don't know i mean this is like my dream like having a podcast is like my literal dream so well, there you go babe here you go but slap that like button if you guys want a podcast but yeah babe so tell us about that little uh that little friend you had there <laughs> So we're getting out of the car today. Literally, this is what, like maybe now, now, maybe like four <laughs> hours Could be. ago. Could we're getting be. out of the car. And um, this one area like by where we parked my car, there's all these leaves. And when I mean like all these leaves, I mean like probably like a foot worth of leaves piled up. Well, half of it's like Wood. two by fours. Yeah, it's like two by fours, but then like leaves have just covered it and it's just yeah. been straight yeah. up neglected. Yeah. yeah. So it's always a little, um, what would you say? Like sketchy, sketchy walking yeah. through it. Like I always yeah. think something's going to happen when I'm walking through these leaves. <laughs> so today I go to get out of the car and we live in Texas. So like when you get out of the car at nighttime, you have to get out really quickly or just bugs swarm in Mosquitoes, the car. Mosquitoes, freaking bugs. So the second you open that door and the car light comes on, like you got to get, you got to get out of the car. So I open the door. I go to step my foot out of the car and all of a sudden I just see something go and move. And I was like, <sighs> true story. She literally freaked out. She goes, something was out there. Oh my God. Is it, is it a person? Like what? 
What did you see? She goes, I don't know, but it moved. So being the brave soul I am. Wait, And for the record, wait. this is like the first time I've driven. Yeah, that is true. So now I and think Andrew I'm good for drives. the next like month and a half of not having to drive because of this. Yeah, no, but before Andrew gets ahead of the story, I thought, why did you just do that? I don't know. I felt like a smell. Yeah. <laughs> it smells like, it smells like candy, honestly. Okay. Um, <laughs> can I get back to the story? I guess. I thought, first of all, Andrew, you're going to hear up. that. Focus up, babe. If you want to be a podcaster, you oh got to be ready God. for your, for your, uh, your, uh, what yeah. is it? Your, uh, your guest to be doing some weird stuff. Okay. Well, I thought, first of all, that it was a snake. I was sure that it was a snake or a mouse. That's actually what I first and you thought. Didn't I say, really you thought said it was you a didn't mouse. Know. Well, I didn't want to creep you out because I needed you to go check it out. So oh. if I said it was a snake, I know you wouldn't have gone and Oh left. my God. That is effed up. That's just the I truth. I almost died. I almost died today. So add that to the bad day. But then, uh, then sh the short story, long, sh short, what we did was I went around, the brave soul I am. I turned on my light, and there I saw. A freaking toad. It was a cute little toad. We, I took a Snapchat of it. It might, we might be able to put it on here. I don't know if you're like how this is gonna go. Yeah, I can do that. But uh, if I might not have it, like I don't know if I saved it. I might have just deleted it. But there was a little toad, and then I showed Claire, and she got out, and it was really cool. And uh, then we go inside, and where we were when we uh, got back was we actually stopped at Taco Bell. And okay, tell me if this is a complex order. Okay, two Mexi melts, which is like a talk, it's like a soft taco. Okay, two. And then we got two nacho fries, okay? Now tell me, and a Baja Blast. Yeah. A pretty basic order. You know, it's just two things, but two of those two things, okay? We get home, okay? And there's one of the Mexi Melts, broke my heart. And then my brother also got one of the nacho fries, and I also got a nacho fry. He took his nacho fry, ran off. I go to grab my nacho fry, and there is four fries like literally four fries i posted on it or on twitter the other day and uh like the f dude how do you just not give someone a full thing of fries i know it seems like a stupid thing but after having the day we had it is completely justified this day freaking sucked what else happened though there was something else right like i know there was something um, else there had to have been what are we what are we missing oh last night the power went out for an hour and a half oh yeah Claire oh, yeah. beat me once again in freaking Nintendo Smash or Super Mario Party. Beat me again. She's 3-0 against me. Well, That's an issue. Well, I just have to say that I look like this. Well, this is what I look like coming out of my mother's womb. No makeup, hair up, and Not greasy. Bad. Hmm. And speaking of coming out of my mother's womb, my birthday was yesterday. <laughs> hey, happy birthday, babe. We didn't know. So We didn't know that. We have to add every audio in here so we can see what it sounds like. So yeah, my had my birthday weekend this weekend on a lighter and brighter note. Andrew and I got to go down to Dallas. We got an Airbnb. We got to eat some ramen and we kind of just hung, I don't out. Know, hung out, had hung fun. Out. And then last night we were hanging out, having fun, barbecuing and the power just goes out for like what? It was like three hours. Like Yeah, it was a like long out. power outage. It was it was deep. And it just made me think, wow. There's really nothing to do in the power. <laughs> yeah, like literally, if you guys ever feel like testing your uh, your like skills, just shut the power off <laughs> and don't have Wi-Fi. Don't have like any cellular service. Just shut it all off and see if you could survive. If we had like another hour and a half, babe, I don't think we'd be making we this podcast survived. right now. We could have survived. Yeah, I don't know. But off to a new segment of the podcast. Have you guys heard of how poor our days were? Um, this segment is going to be called, What's in the News? What are some news stories you've been pay paying attention to, babe? Like, what's going on in your life that you've seen? Like, anything up with the Kardashians? I know you were listening to something well, about the yeah, Kardashians. Well, yeah, you what's know the, the real new tea. What is that? Tana. Oh, yeah, Tana Mojo and Jake Paul. Yeah, got engaged. Yeah, I don't buy it. Anyone that buys them getting engaged is not the brightest of the bunch. I mean, obviously, their publicists are, like, pretty much the smartest well, that's what I'm saying. I'm that like, have ever lived. Like, I know a lot of people earth. think Jake Paul's stupid. I know a lot of people think Tana Mojo's stupid. I'm not going to tell you my opinions, but I can tell you they're smart enough to know getting married right now is not the good. Have they been dating for like a month? I mean, she literally just turned 21. That's like what the whole thing is about. It's like she just turned 21. Yeah, no, there, there ain't and no her shot. Her MTV show actually is dating. coming out in like, I don't know, two weeks or something like that. She's got an MTV show? Yeah, about her turning 21. Is it like a one-off show? It's like a reality show. Like it would be like... Um, like one show or is it like Jersey Shore, like a full season? It's like a full season. Of her only turning 21? It's like, it's Tana. How do you say her last name? I think it's Mojo, right? 
I don't know. It's spelled really weird. I don't know. I think it's mojo. <laughs> I, I could be way wrong. I have no idea. We know how to say it, but no, like, yeah, I think it's like a full, it's a full thing. Like no she'd been working on it forever. She did that release video. You never saw that? Gosh. I don't really watch like any YouTubers besides like 17 and she's not, unfortunately not one of them. Who's 17? Do you want me to tell you all 17? Oh, oh, oh. You're saying you watch, you don't watch a lot of YouTuber YouTubers except 17 except YouTubers. 17 yeah 17 oh. youtubers yeah hopefully this audio works i am so scared i see the things moving over there yeah you need to stop looking over at it i can't it's literally so i literally can't stop looking like i know this podcast might suck butthole but it's our first one but this could be the best podcast of all time we don't know but you want to ask me what i'm what's going on in my news stories babe andrew what's going on in your news story? uh well keemstar hosted the first ever minecraft monday event i have no idea who won i never really even played minecraft I so i don't even have know no clue what that is Minecraft or Minecraft Monday? Mm, well, I know what Minecraft is, but I don't know what Minecraft Monday is. So, you know, Fortnite, how it has like that battle royale mode where you like drop in, get no guns, and you find the guns and you go and. Yeah, I said I know what Minecraft is. I don't know what Minecraft Monday is. That's not even how you play Minecraft. That's different. I know. I know what Minecraft is. You build. It's like those little blocks. It's like very. Yeah. yeah. But Minecraft Monday is a mix of Fortnite where you like play battle royale where you drop down, find guns, and kill other people, and Minecraft. Wait, so you're telling me it's called Minecraft Monday, but they play Fortnite on no! Minecraft Monday? You know That's so dumb. How you play Minecraft originally is you like build houses, find loot, storm, and all that stuff. But how you play Fortnite is your main goal is to be the last one alive. That's not really your main goal in Minecraft. But in Minecraft Monday, there's a new mode in Minecraft called, I think it's called uh like survival mode, or what is it called? It's like uh I forget what it's called, but it's like a mo- mode like Battle Royale, like Fortnite. So they made the Fortnite mode in Minecraft and they all drop in and go kill each other. And then the winner gets like $10,000. Riveting. Yeah. So I got to figure out, uh, figure out who won that. I'm assuming it was Ninja. I mean, Ninja wins all these things, but yeah. What's the next subject we can talk about here, babe? Here, wait, hold on. I have things written down. Okay. Yeah, I know. I'm prepared because well. this is my dream. Wow. Well, okay. Okay. Like this is weird. Like, are we going to cut any of this dry space I, or is just one flat? I episode? don't know. I'll decide. We might need a third person, yeah? I put... What? In my notes, Mm. I literally just have farted. Oh, I have a good story. (laughs) Farted? I have a good story. You just kicked the mic. Oops. Or the camera. Are you serious? Sorry. All right, let's hear your farting story, babe. I've told you this story. This happened recently at the gym, but I just thought that this would be a good story. You diarrhea all over the gym? Do you want me to tell the story? Does it involve you diarrheaing all over the gym? It involves me obviously farting. Jesus. Okay. Yeah, of course I want to hear this. Are you serious? Let's go. <sighs> okay. So the other day I went to the gym and uh, I was on the stair stepper, stair master, whatever it's called. Stair master 3000. That little 3, like, thing where you yep. like, walk up the stairs, yep. right? This girl gets, uh, well, okay. <clears throat> I, I have to rewind a little bit because I was in the dressing room like beforehand mm-hmm. where, you know, you're get dressed <laughs> Sick. i don't know like the locker room like where you yeah. put your stuff away and i feel like there's two kinds of girls at the gym there's girls that mm-hmm. are like grungy looking like not cute and then there's girls that look really really cute at the gym i don't have any bias against either i'm just not a girl that looks cute at the gym like i'm never that person because i look very ugly when i work out and i like get blotchy and red and it's disgusting so there's really no point in me looking good but like this girl literally had a red lip on like she was wearing red lipstick. Like she looked beautiful. When you say a red lip, does it make it look like you have one red lip? No, like that's just like the way you would say it. Like a red lip. Like I have a bold lip. Like I'm wearing a bold lip tonight. That would be like you're wearing like a red lip or like a purple lip. I don't know, Andrew. Get with the times. Gosh. So pretty much this girl's like she's literally wearing red lipstick. There mm. you go. I'll just make it easier for you. She's literally wearing red lipstick. Okay. I see her in the dressing room. I'm just like, Wow. First of all, how? Yeah, all right. Second of all, good for you, girl. I don't look like that. So there's like 10, literally 10. Um, stair masters. Stair masters, like whatever. Okay, you get Steppers, stair steppers. So there's 10 of them. There's literally no <coughs> one there. It's nighttime, whatever. So I get on the stair master and sometimes your girl is a little gassy, okay? And a lot of the times like when you're working out, it's kind of like just whatever. Okay. Fart on the stair master. <laughs> So I did. I let one rip. <laughs> so just, the like, couch. just like the couch did. <laughs> Jesus. I let one rip. And let me tell you guys, 
it was foul. Like it was not good. It was just not good. Mm. And I was like, thank God nobody is around here. Mm. But it lingered. I don't know why it lingered, but it just lingered. All of a sudden, I see the girl. Red lip girl? Red lip girl. Oh, God. Walk up, gets on the stair ma- master next to me. And I'm like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. She is literally smelling and she's in my fart air. She's literally just breathing in my fart air. Wow. And she's like gorgeous. Like, I- I don't know why. Oh, she was one of the hot ones, not the raunchy ones? No, she was hot. Dang. I don't know why I felt more self-conscious because she was gorgeous, but I just feel like beautiful girls don't yeah. fart. You know, that like whole BS thing. Yeah. yeah but it's yeah. like. Wait, do they? Yeah. They do. What? So I was like, oh my gosh. Then, no, it gets worse. It gets worse. So then I'm like, I have my Bluetooth on because I'm wearing my AirPods. Yeah. Casual flex. I know. And, um, all of a sudden her beats connect to my phone. Oh, yeah, so the then worst. she looks over at me and we're making like the most awkward eye contact of my life. She's mm. just breathing in my fart particles. And now I'm connected to her beats. Oh, she, wait, was she connected to yours then? No. It so just what connected was- my AirPods and connected her beats to my music. Wait, so yeah, she was listening to your music. Yeah. What was the song you were playing? I, I was playing a YouTube video. I don't remember which one. Oh, no. I don't ever stare master without watching YouTube video. I Whoa. Can't music. That's trippy. Wow. It was the worst moment of my life. So then, yeah. Wow. Yeah, I, I don't know if I can top that, babe. Um, That's why I don't go to the gym. Because I'm not farting and letting some smoke show <laughs> smell my farts. And yeah, this is uh, not really relatable to Claire at all or uh, anyone probably else. Maybe some of you guys... But, uh, you know, I'm a pretty avid Call of Duty player, I'd say. I like Call of Duty. When the F is this new Call of Duty mobile game coming out? Babe, do you know? I don't even know clue what you're talking about. Well, there's a new Call of Duty mobile game. It's supposed to come out. I mean, they announced it like months ago. And the new Call of Duty game's coming out soon. So, like, what what are they trying to do here? Like, are they trying to, like, make me play mobile for, like, a day and then go off to the new COD? You know what I'm saying? It's freaking stupid. This, this, this has been a mess. This has been an absolute mess. I'm sad. I'm lonely. And I'm not, I'm not staying near Claire because she just farts everywhere. Why apparently. are you lonely? You fart. Well, I wasn't lonely until you said you farted on this lady's face. I didn't fart. And now in I'm her afraid face. of you. I farted in her vicinity. I'm literally scared. Well, actually, of you. I'm literally she, scared of you now. She walked into my fart vicinity. She walked into the fart. She walked into it. Did she fart while she walked onto your fart? She could have farted. It. No one would have ever known. Maybe she farted. And she's like, oh my god, this poor lady. And then her music, and she's probably, like, oh my god. It was just so awkward because it was just like so clearly me that farted. I was the only one on the Stairmaster. Wow. That's hot. That's actually hot. Just kidding. That's not hot. But that is probably a good spot to end this since uh, it's kind of our first ever thing like this. We have literally no clue if this is going to work. There's a very good shot that uh, this video is just for me and Claire to just get mad at because we're like, oh, sick. I can't wait to hear us talk about Claire farting on everyone and hearing in the mic but uh yeah let us know let us know if you like this little setup here it's kind yeah. of a cool little setup yeah. i mean it's not the greatest thing ever but it's kind of cool the couch is kind of old uh yeah just let us know how the audio sounds or any segments you guys want or if you want a daily podcast where we talk like this we could talk about re- recent events and news yeah. we might YouTube we might news. have it a little bit more organized yeah today was just kind of like let's try it Testing let's give it a Zawadas. shot but definitely give your guys' feedback on this. Definitely let us know if this is what you like. If it's not what you like, we are just trying things out, you guys, and really trying to live my dream out because this is truly my dream. Her dream is to be on a couch with me. No. But we're out of here, babe. Close us out of here. Make sure before you guys leave to like and subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Could be a podcast. Could be a freaking thing. Who knows? But we'll see you then. I appreciate it.